If you've been following the clean energy sector lately, particularly in hydrogen and fuel cell technology, one name has been showing up in headlines again and again, plug power. Whether it's new deployments, major financing deals, or strategic restructuring, the company seems to be in constant motion this year. But here's the thing, while the headlines often focus on one or two big announcements, there's a much richer story unfolding behind the scenes. 2025 is turning into a pivotal year for Plug Power, not just because of what they're building, but because of how they're positioning themselves for the next decade. In this video, we're going to unpack those stories one by one, starting with a small town in California that just proved hydrogen can be a reliable, community-scale power source. We'll then look at what's happening with Plug Power's margins and why their restructuring plan is one of the most important developments to watch. We'll cover the rapid growth in their electrolyzer business, the significance of a massive federal loan guarantee, and finally, tie it all together into what it means for the future of hydrogen. So, let's begin with one of the most practical, real-world examples of hydrogen deployment we've seen so far this year. Story 1, a town that runs on hydrogen. Imagine you live in a small California town that's no stranger to wildfire risk. You know that every summer, there's a chance the power lines will be shut off for safety, leaving the community in the dark. In most places, that's where the diesel generators kick in, loud, smelly, and pumping out emissions until the grid comes back online. Now imagine a completely different scenario. When the grid goes down, instead of the roar of diesel engines, you hear almost nothing. The lights stay on. Refrigerators keep running. Emergency services remain operational. And the only thing being emitted into the air is a little water vapor. That's exactly what's happening now in Calistoga, California. The town recently replaced its diesel-based backup system with a hybrid microgrid built around six plug power PEM fuel cells. These cells are paired with battery storage for load management, and an 80,000-gallon liquid hydrogen reserve to ensure extended run times. The result? This system can keep the entire town powered for up to 48 hours during an outage, without burning a drop of diesel. It's quiet, it's clean, and it's scalable. From an engineering perspective, this isn't just about replacing diesel, it's about proving that hydrogen fuel cells can operate at a community scale in a cost-effective and reliable way. For policymakers and utilities, it's a real-life case study in how hydrogen can fit into the resilience toolkit. And for plug power, it's a high-visibility showcase of their stationary fuel cell technology, one that can be replicated in dozens of other towns, campuses, or industrial sites facing similar challenges. Story 2, margins moving in the right direction while Calistoga shows us what hydrogen can do in the field, another important story is happening inside Plug Power's balance sheet. For years, the company has faced criticism over its financial performance, and not without reason. Margins have been deeply negative, and profitability has remained elusive. Enter Project Quantum Leap, Plug Power's ambitious restructuring effort launched to reset costs and streamline operations. At its core, this plan is about tightening the company's footprint and focusing resources where they can have the most impact. That has meant consolidating facilities, renegotiating supplier contracts, and, unfortunately, reducing headcount. In total, about 261 roles were cut, including positions at their new headquarters in Bethlehem, New York. The immediate results are already visible. In the second quarter of 2025, Plug's gross margin improved from minus 92% a year earlier to minus 31%. Now, minus 31% is still negative, but that kind of improvement in just 12 months is notable. Management is aiming for run rate gross margin breakeven by the fourth quarter of this year. That's an aggressive goal, and whether they hit it or not will be a key test of the restructuring success. For investors and analysts, margin improvement is a sign that Plug is getting better at controlling service costs, lowering production expenses, and securing more favorable hydrogen supply deals. For customers, it can mean more competitive pricing and potentially faster project payback periods. Story 3, Electrolyzer business picks up beyond fuel cells, Plug Power has another major growth driver, their Electrolyzer division. Electrolyzers are the machines that split water into hydrogen and oxygen using electricity, and when that electricity comes from renewable sources, the hydrogen produced is completely green. In the past year, this business has shifted from steady to surging. In the second quarter of 2025 alone, electrolyzer revenue tripled, reaching around $45 million. More than 230 megawatts of projects are currently mobilizing across Europe, Australia, and North America. Why does this matter? because green hydrogen production is the bottleneck in scaling a hydrogen economy. 
If you can't make enough affordable green hydrogen, fuel cells can't be deployed at scale. Plugs electrolyzers, especially their PEM based Gen Eco line, are designed for modular scalability, which means they can be used in everything from small on site generation units to massive industrial hydrogen hubs. A recent multi year hydrogen supply agreement, secured on improved economics, should also help keep costs in check, a critical factor for customers looking to lock in predictable fuel pricing. Story 4 $1.66 billion to build more hydrogen plants. If you're wondering how plug plans to supply all this hydrogen to customers, the answer lies in their expanding production network. In January 2025, the company closed on a $1.66 billion loan guarantee from the U.S. Department of Energy. This financing is earmarked for multiple new green hydrogen plants, with the first set to break ground in Graham, Texas. These new facilities will join Plug's existing plants in Georgia, Tennessee, and Louisiana, which currently produce around 45 tons of hydrogen per day in total. By scaling production, Plug not only secures fuel for its own customer base but also strengthens its vertical integration strategy, controlling both the hardware and the fuel supply chain. From a business model perspective, this is critical. It allows Plug to bundle equipment, fuel, and service into long-term contracts that generate recurring revenue and deepen customer relationships. It also positions the company to benefit from production tax credits under the Inflation Reduction Act, which can significantly improve project economics. Story 5 what it all means taken individually, each of these stories is significant. The Calistoga project shows hydrogen as a practical resilience tool. Project Quantum Leap demonstrates a commitment to financial discipline. The electrolyzer surge highlights the potential for green hydrogen production growth. And the DOE loan guarantee signals confidence in Plug's ability to scale supply infrastructure. Put them together, and you see a company that's evolving from a pure play fuel cell manufacturer into a full-spectrum hydrogen solutions provider, one that designs the technology, produces the fuel, builds the infrastructure, and maintains the systems. Of course, challenges remain. Hydrogen production costs are still higher than fossil alternatives in most markets, infrastructure build-out is capital-intensive, and competition from battery electric systems is growing. But the trajectory is clear, Plug Power is positioning itself at the intersection of hardware, fuel supply, and service, and that's a powerful place to be in an industry that's still defining its major players. Final thoughts and AMP, call to action if you're watching this and thinking, I want to understand this space well enough to build my own hydrogen project, the time to start is now. You have two clear paths. Get the complete green hydrogen project development and AMP, financing courses at ReneeEnergy.com a step-by-step -step program covering feasibility studies, permitting, offtake agreements, financial modeling, and more. Join H2 Hub for a monthly subscription, giving you access to premium tools, ready-to-use templates, and expert insights that will save you months of research and planning. Both options are designed to help you move from just reading about hydrogen projects to actually building them. Visit ReneeEnergy.com or h2hub.reneeenergy.com today and start shaping your role in the hydrogen economy.